Hi, in this video we are going to learn how to insert n number of arithmetic means between any two given quantities. So suppose if we have two quantities like a and b and then if we want to insert n number of terms between these two quantities in such a way that a1 is the first term and then we have a2 till a n right then these quantities these newly inserted quantities will be called arithmetic means between a and b if the series formed by writing these numbers between a and b are in arithmetic progression if the series starting from a and ending at b along with these n insertions is in arithmetic progression then these insertions or these numbers are called n arithmetic means between a and b right so how to find these numbers yes if i can find the common difference d between these numbers i can very well write the series right so to understand how to find this common difference let me take one example and while solving that example we will understand it better how to find these n number of arithmetic means between two given quantities so let me erase this work so the example we are going to solve is insert 20 arithmetic means between 4 and 67 right so we have two numbers first is 4 and the last one is 67 right and we have to insert 20 arithmetic means so these 20 arithmetic means will be starting from a1 then a2 then we will have a3 and this will last till a20 and the last number will be 67 so what do we have now we have our first term as 4 we represent first term as a this is equal to 4 right and then we have our last term as 67 so l is 67 right and then how many number of total terms do we have we have to insert 20 arithmetic means between 4 and 67 right so if we insert these arithmetic means in such a way that including 4 and 67 including 4 as the first term and 67 as the last term they form an arithmetic progression we write it as AP so how many total terms will be there yes we are inserting 20 terms in between right and then we have one term in the beginning and then we have one term in the end right so total number of terms in this case will be 20 plus 2 that is 22 right yes and by inserting these 20 arithmetic means we are actually writing a series of 22 terms starting from 4 and ending at 67 right so what is the formula of last term formula of last term for arithmetic progression is a plus n minus 1 d right and if somehow we can find this d or the common difference for this arithmetic progression we can find all these 20 terms which needs to be inserted between 4 and 67 right so last term we have as 67 this will be equal to a which is 4 plus n minus 1 n is 22 minus 1 and d we have to find right and if we shift this 4 from right side to left side it will become 67 minus 4 is equal to 22 minus 1 is 21 D right and 67 minus 4 is 63 63 is equal to 21 D and from here we can find D is equal to 63 by 21 this will be equal to 3 right so we have found d is equal to 3 and now we can find these 20 terms easily right so let's erase this calculation which we have done to find the common difference first term we have as 4 right second term will be 4 plus 3 7 so this series will be 4 7 and the third term will be 7 plus 3 10 then we will have 13 then we will have 16 19 and after this we'll have 22 25 28 
31 and then we will have 34, 37, 40, 43, 46, 49, 52, 55, 58, 61, 64 and 67. This will be the series, right? First term we have as 4, right? And the last term we have 67 and in between 4 and 67 we have inserted these 20 terms, right? So these 20 terms starting from 7 till 64 are the 20 arithmetic means between 4 and 67, right? And here we have inserted only 20 arithmetic means. We can actually insert any number of arithmetic means between any two given numbers. So this is the method of finding the arithmetic means between any two given numbers. So in next video, I'll be writing general formula or the generalized series to find n number of arithmetic means between any two given numbers. So keep watching MathSmart and subscribe to MathSmart to keep updated about new editions.